Hey everyone, I'm a rainbow volunteer. My name is Jenny, and today I want to show you guys how to make a secret letter origami style. So to make our secret letter, you're first going to have an 8.5 by 11 piece of paper. You're going to write down whatever message you want. I decided to write to you guys and include a little Winnie the Pooh quote. Okay, let's get started. So the first fold is the bottom right corner all the way to the left edge, as far as it can go. Crease it well. Unfold it. And now you're going to do the same thing from the left bottom corner to the right edge. Fold it. You should have this X in the middle. You're going to turn it over and you're going to fold from the bottom to the top and you want to stop the fold where the X meets. So I'm going to keep going until I see where the X is. It's right there. So I'm going to fold it. Open it back up. You should have this X here and the one fold going through the middle. So you're going to press down and you should see that this pops up here. So you're going to fold this in and as you fold it in, you're going to push all of it up. So fold in and push. And it should turn into this triangle. Press it down. Crease it. From here, you're going to take this corner and fold it in. Like that. And you're going to do the same thing over here. There's that. So that was just a folding in. Next, we're going to take the right flap and open it up like so. See how it opens? Okay. You're going to open it up and you should already see this corner starting to lean in. You're just going to go with that, push it down, and it should form a square and flatten it out like that. That was from this flap to a square and you're going to do the same thing over here. Open it up, push the corner down, and flatten it out like that. So now you should have two squares. You're gonna take the top left corner of the right square and fold it down diagonally like that. You're gonna take the top right corner of the left square and fold it down the other way like that. So we just turned our squares back into some triangles. Okay, so you see this middle diamond area? You're gonna take the top half of the diamond and fold it down, right in half. Like that. Okay, in the next part, we're gonna take a look at this triangle down here. And we're gonna fold it up to where it meets the other bottoms of squares. Just like that, fold it in. And then what we're gonna do if you take a look from the top view, you'll see that there is a hole or a space there behind here. You're going to want to fold this big triangle into that space. So the triangle's up here. You're just going to tuck it into there. Just like that. So that was from triangle to a tuck. From here, we're gonna take the sides and we're gonna fold them into the center. So it's gonna look like this. The side, fold it. So the top edges line up. And this should be relatively center, this edge. You're gonna do the same thing over here. So it lines up at the top. It's okay if it's not perfect, no big deal. And it should look something like this. From here, you're going to fold the corners also down to the center. So you're gonna start here, fold it in like that. So that just went from here to here. Do the same thing with the other side to the center. Again, it's okay if it's not perfect. Just like that. And then all you have to do is tuck it inside the space here. Like that. Fold it in. 
And now you have the perfect little envelope with a secret message to hand off to someone else.